gotta turn my fan off. Now it might get hot in here. And I'm back with another vlog. Uh, and uh, I've been working in the heat this week. Yeah, it's, it's been in the 100 degree area. Yeah, it's not so bad in the early hours, the, be the beginning of my job, but then after about 10 a.m., then you usually really start to feel the heat. So yeah, I'm really thankful that my uh, my job only goes till 2 p.m. Uh, but even then, I still get really hot uh, towards the end. So yeah, yeah, I've just, just been trying to stay cool uh, these past two weeks, I guess. It's been the hottest part of this summer so far might get hotter still. I've also been reading books about autism, uh, just trying to learn as much as I can about it, because uh, even though I have it, that doesn't make me an expert. So yeah, yeah, and uh, one thing, uh, the, I found interesting uh, is that it one book it mentioned what's called a sh social out uh, like the way it, the book described it was uh, if a person's in a situation uh, was uh, people uh, and they want to leave uh, then that they have to come up with uh, a way to excuse themselves like uh, a reason to leave I need to visit the restroom Be right back. and uh, a lot of people who have autism aren't good with coming up with a reason or or, or uh, just giving a reason and uh, they might just disappear uh, w without telling anyone uh, which I have done before uh, I just kind of slip out without anyone noticing me. And it is one of those things that uh, people do all the time. Uh, but, you know, for autistic people like myself, we, uh, we just don't know about it or like don't, don't know how to do it or, or when to do it, or, or what to say. I, I think I left the oven on. Yeah, I think I left your oven on too. And, and with me, uh, if I'm uh, in a situation and not really enjoying it, uh, I, I just, like, the, the sooner I get through this, the sooner it will be over, and then I don't have to to deal with it. I kind of just wish this would all be over as soon as possible. But instead of wishing that it was over, I could just excuse myself and leave. That may end it, or or at least I could get a break from it. But yeah, yeah, it's just 
you know, like one of those salsa rolls that that uh, autistic people don't always know about or don't know how to follow because uh, sometimes uh, the people with autism might say something and it comes off as rude or insensitive but uh, they they didn't mean to be or or you, you know it's just the situation that they were in and is making them feel uh, bad, I guess, and they, they kind of lash out. That's it, I'm out of here. But yeah, yeah, the, that stuff has happened to me where I've been in situations and, and I just don't want to be there anymore and I just want to leave and, and yeah, get away from it. You know, when you're a kid and you're out with your parents and you want to leave, but sometimes your parents won't let you and they make you stay and and you're forced to stay because you're just a kid and you're with your parents. So, so you, you have to stay with them and go where they go. but. But uh, when you get older, then then you you can leave when you want to leave. Yeah, but it just doesn't always dawn on me that I can just leave, uh, uh, find find a, a way to uh, get get away and, instead of just putting up with it. I, I should come up with some excuses uh, to use so then I will have them ready when I need them. So yeah, 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 maybe I'll do that. And then it will make, then that will make it easier to leave. So, and so I'll know what to say in advance. Yeah, that, that, that could help. So that's going to be it for this vlog. Until next video, goodbye. That's my video out. Yeah. Can't use that in real life. <laughs> no. I'm out of here.